This high. I'm afraid of heights. Yeah, thank you. I'm scared of heights. Well, it's perfect. It's the fly loft of the Wells Theater. We're talking about our setting the stage campaign. It just seemed like the right place. So much great work is being done up here. For over a hundred years, this has been a working facility. And what we're doing now is, where do we go for the next hundred years? Great as the shows were. We're broke. Yeah, I mean, who is it? We're broke, we're broke. We're broke, yeah. everybody's broke. Yeah. The arts especially. It's, it's... But the big thing is, right now, a major opportunity in front of us. Major opportunity. We've got a $100,000 challenge grant. $100,000, $100,000 challenge grant sitting on the table <laughs> if if we raise a hundred thousand dollars to have this kind of an opportunity major opportunity is what's going to allow us to get past this terrible year <laughs> Keith and I have been working towards a plan for this company that really changes, in some ways, what we think about American theater. How do theaters look at and serve the region that they live in? And we've got plans for that. This last year, we rolled out the first play in our American Soil series, your, your play about lying in the sand. Fifty years ago, Hampton Roads was ground zero for public school integration. The audiences responded so strongly to it. We're opening up our next season with Alive and Well, Kenny Finkel's new play about the differences of the North and the South and the way the Civil War still lives. And from there, we're going on to a play about military families. For anybody that doesn't know Virginia Stage Company, that's not all that we do. We open this season with an amazing production, I will say, of yeah. My Fair Lady. We did uh, Ella. We do a lot oh. of mainstream, very popular stuff, but with real imagination, yeah? Also, people don't, a lot of people don't know about our education and outreach programs. Oh, yeah. 40,000 students, 40,000 40, students every year for the last five years. Introducing kids to whole new ideas in society using theater to get there. We've got all these great things going on with the stage, with the education programs, but it all keeps coming back to one thing. It's getting out of this last year. The money thing. We need people's help and support. We've got a $100,000 challenge right on the table. Our audiences, our subscribers, those are going to make the difference in this particular $100,000 challenge. Get past this terrible year. It's everybody chipping in what they can. So much great work is being done up here. Please, if you can, join us for that. Thank you. Thank you for your time. And forwarding this on to your friends all around the country. Does that mean that I can go downstairs yeah, I think now? We're, thank we're you. done setting the stage. I think we can go down. All right. Thank you. I, I, I made it. I made it. We've been viral. We've been <laughs> the flies. But no, we can... I think it went pretty well. What do you think? That no, was great. I think uh, people will really appreciate what you said. Well, I don't know. I think people will get money. <laughs>